Florida Attorney General has been outspoken advocate of President Donald Trump. There's even been talk at one point of her joining his administration. News Channel 8's Ryan Hughes spoke to Pam Bondi about the president's summit in Singapore and the recent lawsuit against the Trump Foundation that's reviving a connection to Pam Bondi. Pam Bondi and the president. The two have shared a cozy bond for years. The attorney general, a leading advocate for Donald Trump. We caught up with her in Tampa and wanted her take on the Singapore summit. He's done something remarkable. And as he said, he would travel millions of miles to save. If we can save millions of people's lives and denuclearize this, this world, I mean, that's a huge step in the right direction. Bondi revealed to me that she spoke with the president on the phone before he met with North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. Just personal conversation um, and how proud I am of what he was doing and that, that he was going over there and, in my opinion, risking his safety. Recently, the New York Attorney General sued the Trump Foundation, accusing the charity and the Trump family of violations of campaign finance laws. Bondi is mentioned in the suit because the foundation in 2013 sent a $25,000 check to her election committee and for justice for all. Trump Foundation officials said they were uncertain if the money went to a charity by the same name. I do not believe it's fair um, because they mentioned a contribution he had given to me that, um, that I know was corrected immediately when they realized it went to, a, there was a nonprofit that had the same name as my PAC. As for her political aspirations after she's termed out as AG, Bondi approached it with uncertainty and a little bit of levity. I, I truly have not decided, and if someone claims to know what I'm doing, it's not true because I haven't told anyone. So um, when I decide, I will tell you. I'm Ryan Hughes, News Channel 8.